there is this um uh, there's this um ideology that people have about um this bunkery and all of that that there are major stakeholders in this country that are behind this the people in the sea are just uh, uh are just workers they have the the, the main corporates are behind and anytime vessel is God's in there is always they always set it ablaze mm -hmm. according to what Nate Woko said that this is to cover all the evidence and I mean how do you get evidence if something is being burnt to ashes so what's your position on what he said how do, how do you align with what he just said you know I, I've never like I've, I keep uh, trying to figure out the logic behind burning down of uh, burning uh, vehicles you know uh, uh, recovered from uh, oil thieves and all of that I just keep trying to understand the logic behind it why are you burning the vehicle why are you destroying the oil what's what's your exact reason for that there's no logic for that it, instead what it does to the environment is to even further damage the environment you know you might say that it's away from the city but it's an ecosystem everything circulate everything is kind of connected you burn this thing they go into the air the the oil sink back into the ground and maybe damage that ground you know uh, 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 you know, <laughs> I'm actually following up on the Ogoni cleanup, and I know how much it costs to actually clean up uh, 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 spilled oil. Then now you're deliberately spilling those oil on the ground by burning uh, the, 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 the I'm not even trying to even talk about it from the area of uh, evidence and all of that. But yes, Ned actually have uh, 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 Senator Ned actually have a point on that. They actually, yeah, there should be a reason. What's the logic behind burning the, this thing? If you recover this thing from these people, why not? If you don't want to take them to court, if you don't want to uh, charge them for oil theft and all of that, or let's say they escaped, let's assume they escaped, why don't you take the oil back to the company, like oh, particularly the one owning the this thing? Or if it's government owned it, you know, or you, you, you leave it, you, you, you present it to the court for the court to decide where uh, the stolen, uh, this thing, this, the recovered uh, stolen oil and the vehicle will be returned to. You know, we've had uh, issues where um, both EFCC and Custom actually uh, do a uh, uh, vehicle auctions. Those are vehicles that have stayed in their possession or maybe vehicles uh, recovered from criminals. Uh, uh, sorry, from let, let me not call them criminal. From uh, uh, you know uh, people that have been alleged of committed crimes. You know all those vehicles. You know it's the court. It's for the court to decide and say, okay, do this to this vehicle, auction it, then let uh, 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 the money for which it is sold be paid into the government coffers. By so doing, it benefits the government and it benefits the society. So why exactly are you? Burning it. What does this? What purpose does this serve? Burning it. Does it prevent the oil theft? Because they, they keep on doing it, despite all the burning. 